Hey guys, Leif here from uh, ATEC Office Technology. Today I'm going to show you the uh, new PaperCut uh, MF uh, interface with the Konica Minolta embedded uh, solution. So if you have a look at the screen here, uh, this is version 16.3 and it's running on Konica Minolta C308, so the new 8 series. This is the uh, login uh, screen for PaperCut. I've got the option of username and password or ID number or also the swipe card. So I'm just going to go in with ID number in this case. Uh, I've got a nice and simple ID, just number one. So I type in the ID there and hit OK and login. And I'm now at the PaperCut home login screen. So I'm just going to explain these three options before I go into it. Uh, number one is the print release so this will only show up if you have the print release enabled on the printer which means that if you send print jobs to the printer they will all be queued up in there and you can go in you'd click on print release and hit release all at the moment I don't have any jobs in the queue uh, the middle function here the device functions that will basically take you to the home screen of the photocopier where you've got all your copy and scan and user box and all those uh, options in there. The third option is the uh, new scan actions. So I'm going to go through a couple of those in a minute as well. So the scan actions, that's just another way of setting up a scan shortcut. Uh, but let's go into device functions. Oops, just waited too long there. I'll just uh, quickly log in again number one login okay so we'll go into device functions and you can now see we're logged into the home screen and uh, from here of course I'm not going to cover those in this tutorial but your copy and scan fax options uh, normally you would go into the scan fax select me and that will uh, give you the scan to email functionality so but I'm just gonna reset that and go back to the main menu if I click on the app button here I can go back to those other two screen options and on the paper cut home screen so if I go into the release option first I'll just show you that uh, as I mentioned before there are no print jobs awaiting release but if I had print jobs in here, there will be a release all button there and they will all print out. Uh, now I'm just going to go back to device functions, as in back to the home menu. If I go back into the app button, I can go into the scan uh, button there. So this scan button that's called uh, PaperCut calls is scan actions. So I'm going to go into there and show you another way you can scan in PaperCut and uh, I've set up two scan actions or two different scan settings if you want to call it that or so I've got one scan to my email so if I select that one uh, I'm just going to put a page in the document feeder so we can do actually do one of those and uh, now on the screen here you can see the scan details we've got who it's sending it to, the subject, we could modify that if we want to do that or modify the file name. I can also click on the settings button here and that gives you a nice uh, uh, layout of the different options such as single and double sided uh, size orientation and uh, file type, resolution and color or grayscale. So, when we're happy with those, just hit start. And that will now be scanned to my email. I get an option there, would you like to scan more? So I can select scan more or just send if I'm happy with that. Scan completed. And a uh, couple of seconds and you can see it reverts back to the uh, home screen again. So that was the one of the scan actions, the scan to email. I'm just going to also show you, it's pretty much exactly the same, but the scan to folder. So I go into scan actions again, go into the send to folder, 
and uh, you can see they're just slightly different you don't have an email and a uh, subject we've only got the file name that we could modify of course I can click in there you know make any changes that I like to the file name and hit OK uh, I could also go in and change any of the settings if need be or just hit start and this will now scan to a shared uh, folder on the on the network again I could scan more or just hit send when I'm completed and uh, so we get the scan completed there and it will now go back to the home screen again so that's pretty much it that's all I wanted to show you when we log out we just hit the access button twice and uh, that's it that's a quick uh, intro to the paper cut uh, embedded uh, solutions <laughs>